Hi guys, um, I'm in the studio and I want to show you guys how I do the heart props um, in our shop. I had some questions on how I stuffed them, so I'm going to show you how I do it with a stand-in baby. So I have baby um, already wrapped here, and what I'm going to do is I'll show you first what I have under here. So this is just fluff, um, and I have two of our pebbles on top of each other to make kind of like a pillow and then I have some burp cloths just thrown um, kind of in the bottom here so they're not laying on the wood and then I put this in and just cover it all up and I make sure that I tuck it in so that we can see the shape of the heart if you have anything hanging out you're not going to be able to see see the shape you also don't want a lot of stuffing in here because it's gonna make it harder to pose and you want baby to be able to sink into it this way. Um, so what I see a lot of people doing is they wanna pose baby like this, kind of straight on. And what I like to do is I like to use this other side too. So when I'm holding baby, I will squish baby in and this is a doll so it doesn't squish as well, but I'll squish baby in sideways like this then bring the head around and then squish down then you want to push the butt down and bring the head up so they're kind of you kind of want them to go like a C and squished in like that and the butt going downwards and then you can bring some fluff or fur around too to kind of make them look like they're more in in there so with this prop it is a little tighter of a squeeze. I typically do this one wrapped, um, different types of wraps with the feet out or all the way wrapped. And, um, or if I have a little baby, then I can do it like that too. So I'll show you guys unwrapped. So again, I would kind of squish baby like in the C position, um, more squished than the sib can go, but squish it kind of like in the C position and then you would lay down. So the, the head is going to be higher than the body and that's what I'm looking for because whatever is closest to the camera is going to look larger. And so I don't want the butt up here while I'm shooting because that's just gonna make it look a lot larger. I like it tucked into the heart. So then I tuck around just like that. And fix the arms or the legs. But you really want that, that C shape. So then kind of squish like this. So head this way and the legs coming around kind of this way. And I'll post some pictures too so you guys can see what I'm talking about. But for this prop, typically, um, because I have both, I use this one mostly for wrapped poses. I just find that it's easier. Um, also, if you're newer at posing, I would say the carved one, this is the marble one, and the carved one is a little easier to pose in. There's more room, um, so this one is definitely easier. So I'll show you how I have this one set up. And I just have, for this, I just have one burp cloth here. And then I have one kind of laid like this, right? Where I know baby's gonna go. And you don't want too much stuffing, so I have a little piece. You don't want a huge thing, because again, it's gonna be too stuffed and you want baby to be able to sink inside and you also wanna see the heart shape. So what I do, as I go around and I'll just tuck all the way around like this. I do want this part a little bit higher. And 
And then I'm going to pose baby um, on my newborn lounger, how I want them first, kind of. And then I'll just put them in again. And I'm not going to go like this and put them in this way because then we're going to have this huge space here um, and they're just not going to fit in it as well. So I'm going to turn kind of C, like a C, squished in. I'm going to put baby's hands up here, here, and then I like to kind of just like rotate their hip a little bit, like this. And then I'm going to take my fur, I'm going to come and I'm going to squish it around here so they really look like they're tucked in. face up. So that's how I like to do um, this one. And you can do little outfits. You can also do a wrap too. It's really cute. And um, we have both of the, the heart props are going to be in the shop. They're in the shop right now until Monday. Um, on Monday, we'll be closing the pre-order and it won't open again probably until next month. So if you guys want any of the hearts, uh, go ahead and go get one. If you guys have any questions, let me know. We have, uh, I think, 13 colors that you can pick from. So we have them in a lot of different colors. Um, go ahead and let me know, though, if you guys have any questions.